What's it like this time of year for you to be able to get back in the community and a new community for you too? Yeah, well, yeah, like you said, we're new here, so I um, just want to get our feet down. Uh, the opportunity presented itself uh, to Blair and me, who um, we were able to create a little friendship. So, um, yeah, we're here. We're here to help and obviously uh, put some smiles on some kids' faces and give them an opportunity to take us some, uh, some toys. What's a message you always want to deliver to these kids when you get in front of them? Uh, I mean, it's just about encouragement, support, um, sense of community. Uh, Christmas is my favorite time of the year, personally, ever since I was a kid. So um, just having that holiday spirit and you know, just having that sense of community. Is that something you always knew you wanted to do if you would make it, like, you have to be able to do something like this? Yeah, well, it's always a, a big thing to be able to give back. And, um, you know, I work so hard and come from different uh, communities myself, uh, communities that need people to reach back down into and, um, you know, extend the hand. So, for me to be able to be in this position to, to get back is, is really uh, something I take a lot of pride in. You, hey. said, you, said you started that friendship. How did that start? Uh, just being in the city, um, mutual partners, mutual friends, um, and uh, we're able to you know, dialogue a little bit. And, and you know, I'm one of those people that's always looking for opportunities to help and uh, create and um, you know, make bonds with people. So. This is something that, that was right right away on the agenda for us, and we're able to, to take care of it. Right, to partner with Laramie, Tulsa, like, what does that mean to you to work with uh, Texans and Rockets working together? Yeah, it means a lot. That's what it's about, you know, is creating those partnerships, um, finding people with like interests. Um, I'm always a guy that's, that's big in my, my own communities, uh, whether that was back home in Rockford or in Toronto, and now um, me being here, uh, you know, it's an opportunity for me to to kind of get my feet wet and uh, you know kind of reach out a little bit so um, I have to give a huge thanks to uh, Laramie for putting all this stuff together and uh, you know, I'm just here to uh, uh, you know take all the credit for it today he wasn't able to make it but uh, it's, it's a good opportunity for us. It's been incredible it feels like home you know since the moment uh, I arrived and opened, you know welcomed me with uh, open arms um, my focus has obviously all been on the court, but uh, there's a lot of opportunities off the court to be able to get into a community um, that, that just kind of matches my spirit and um, the culture is something that definitely uh, was, a, was a great fit for me. How important is it for you to have yeah, well, it's not just me. I got a big team behind me. I have people that I work with. My mom, obviously, is in charge of my uh, foundation, so she's kind of the, the brains behind all the operations. And then, you know, I got my kids here with me as well, just to see, you know, how important it is to have that sense of community and um, giving back. You talked about your mom being kind of the brains of the foundation. What, where was kind of, how did it come together? What was the inspiration for the start of the foundation? Well, we've always been been entrenched in our community back home. Um, you know, as you grow, you you know, the, the dollar amounts start to increase. You try to put some structure around it. So we were able to put some structure around it the last couple of years, but uh, kind of focusing on giving back to underserved communities and especially the youth, you know, to open their minds up a little bit because that's kind of where we come from. So we know the importance of it. Do you have a, do you have a favorite memory, a favorite holiday memory from this time of the year? Uh, Favorite toy? No, I, I do know toys used to be a lot cheaper back when I was a kid. So, uh, you know, I got my, my kids, they, they get too much stuff now and tablets and electronics. We, we were playing with a little more harder toys than, than uh, what they get. But uh, it's, it's been a lot of fun to, to watch my own kids grow. And we've done a couple holiday giveaways, um, whether that's in Toronto or back home. So it's cool to see what, what different kids like to, like to pick out.